Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. I'm in the kitchen here with, oh my goodness, our camera. Sam broke our camera. Basically, he broke the little thing. So that's why you saw him yesterday. There was a black shadow. I'm here alone in the kitchen. With Sophie! With Sophie. <laughs> she's, she's already given me so many kisses today. Don't put me away from the sink. Um, uh, last night was the very first night home and Sophie slept downstairs. I had to sleep downstairs. She slept downstairs with me. It was hard. I could yeah. not sleep. She's abandoning me tonight to go back upstairs, right? Yes. Yeah, and that's okay. But anyway. And then some mother and I all sleep downstairs. Some of you guys might know, but I have not washed my hair in seven days. Mom, Wait. Do you think At least eight days. Maybe even think, nine days. But. Do you think they'll want this back because there's bird poop on it? No. There's bird poop on my gown? Oh, gosh. Um, anyways, today I'm going to wash my hair. I have set myself all up here. I've got washcloths. I'm in the kitchen where there's lots of room. I'm going to just wash my hair at the sink. I can stand really well, and I'm going to do that. Guys, we got the chair. It's here. It's a big, huge chair. One day too late, but it's here. Two days too late, but it's here. Morning, guys. It's like Christmas morning because we're getting all these packages I delivered. I asked for and complained about last night. It all came this morning. Anyways, we put the chair together because you have to put it together, and Gabby's trying her out. You can do two at a time. Looks better on the picture when I bought it. Then. And it goes all the way back. Hi. That's perfect from okay, the wall. That's my turn. Is that as far back as it goes? All right, now now do it the other way. Oh, I need to go. Okay. Oh, there's this way, which does both. Okay. Do a, do that, and then go all the way up. I want to see. It's supposed to help you lift up. Keep going. You're going. You're going. And it's lifting you up. It's like a rocket ship. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Did I bolt it to the floor so it doesn't fly away? Okay, that's as far as it gets. That's pretty and then good. When you get back in, you just go like this. That's what I bought it for. For your mom to use. Ooh. And there you have it. The uh, amazing the sleeping so lift coming, yeah. chair. Which is totally Cost mine. To get. It's totally it mine. took forever to get even okay, though I paid so for two day shipping. Well, I guess if you do complain, you do get things faster. It's fun. See, it goes up. You're totally just going to play. It's pretty this. slow though. I think I it was faster. That's better for mom. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, you're off the ground. It's a rocket ship. Oh my you're god. off the ground. Oh That's as far. So. And then go down. Gabby is explaining to me how her computer chair is just no, so. It's your oh, my computer chair that she uses is not nearly as comfy as my wheelchair. Do you find it comfortable? Yeah, except for. Oh, I don't really find it comfortable Which because. Is what you need for like gaming, is when you sit back. It seems it hurts my it hurts my broken bones. Because you're heavier, so I'm lighter, so the pad doesn't sink down. Oh, maybe. Anyway, I'm uh washed my hair. Oh, it feels so good to be clean. I have a new pajamas on, my own pajamas, which is glorious. I have pants on, you guys, actual pants on. Big so achievement. big achievement. Gabby's like, oh, you have pants on. Or maybe it was Sophie. But one of them was shocked that I finally had that pants on. Uh, this chair is working out great for me. This like little hospital table that I've had for a long time. It used to be in my room. I got all my remotes. I've got all my medications. I got my hairspray. I got my brush. I've got like, I have a little bowl of treats. I have everything that I could possibly need. Okay, Gabby's gonna display how she gets over that bump. <laughs> Woohoo! I just don't I did see. It better than you. Yeah, you do it a lot better than me. I've broken bones to watch out for. Um, well, all you have to do is sit. Guys, I rolled this a few nights ago at the hospital. She has no idea the muscles that you need to sit. <laughs> okay, so. Um, when somebody was at the hospital the other day, I didn't get a chance to show this to you guys because all of our um, at, all of our videoing stuff was a mess. But anyway, um, she wrote this letter and it says, I really love my horse. Her name is Stella and I love her because she is so cute and kind and the best horse ever. Here's Sophia. And I wrote, I love my daughter Sophia. She is so kind and gentle and sweet. 
Um, anyway, so the girls are headed. It is uh, almost 12 o'clock. Almost 12 o'clock. I do not want to have my lesson. Why? Because I don't. She's still a little nervous, but our no. instructor is really good at getting her up there and getting her moving and Plus I'm riding storm. Yeah, I, you are riding storm. I saw one person comment um like on um on his edit. I saw someone say Sophie and Storm make a good team. Yeah. Storm makes a good team with anybody that's still learning because he's just an easy horse to anybody ride. That does not fall on his road. He's like, Okay, let's go. <laughs> Me, like, no, slow, slow, slow. Yeah, slow, <laughs> so, slow. so funny. Anyway, they're headed out, and I will not be alone because I'm gonna have my very first physical therapy session. So you guys should know. I'm gonna do a video about all this, all this stuff, and explain it to you. But you guys should know. Every single day, I feel a drastic decrease in pain, and I can do more. Like, I can't walk yet, but I can kind of do a couple of little shuffling steps. I just can't bear complete weight on one side yet. The side that has three brakes. One side has one brake and one side has three brakes. Two. Um, three. You have four brakes? I have four brakes. You said three. Well, one, two, three. Well, I, there, I, my tailbone is broken as well. Yeah. One, two, three. Yeah, no. I have four. I have four brakes. But I'm going to explain it all. Anyways, I'm doing amazing. I'm going to recover so fast. Like, I bet you in a week, I bet you by the time we move, I'm able to move and go to that house and walk up the steps and get into the house myself. Right, they are going to go has... to the barn and they're going to take you guys with them. But I have to tell you something before they go. Last night I dreamed about um, picking chickens for our farm. And this time, like, we've had chickens before. And we've always just ordered multi-purpose uh, Rhode Island breads. And this time, I want a variety of chickens. I want to, like, really love our chickens and have so much fun with them. So I'm going to research some, and I'm excited to do that. I'm going to do that while they're gone. This and is a book that I wrote it in. <laughs> She's in love with that book. All right. See you later. I love you. I love you, too. We are at the barn, and we brought, we brought Ruby with us. There's a what? A cat, a black cat, and still a seal. It's nice out today, isn't it? Come take my hand, I will walk with you. I will let go till you say so. There isn't anything I wouldn't do. Wanna make sure that you understand. You're the one who gives my life color. There is no one other. It's running away from you. Looks like he wants to come, but he might be going around. Boy, Storm. Oh, he has a cut on his eye. Oh, look at his face. It's all full of poop. He has poop. a cut on his eye. Oh my gosh. Ruby. Hi. No grass for you. He's also full of poop on one side. Right. Got Stella. Oh, Stella, you look all shiny, man. You look like you haven't been doing anything in the field. She but looks I good. Know, I'm trying to stay clean from the photo shoot. You look nice and clean. But Storm, on the other hand, well, I'm afraid you got you must have rolled in poop. <laughs> no, he rolled in like mud and went in his stall. That looks like poop. Oh, and got shavings. Oh, okay. Well, we're about an hour early for our lesson. Which gives the slow pokes enough time to groom and bond and groom and tack up and hopefully, hopefully Gabby will be ready. That feeler. Because she is slow. You know the other day I took like 10 pounds of hair off of her? She's still pretty good. Yeah, well that's all her winter fur coming in. I know. 
But it's supposed to be warm again tomorrow, so I, I don't know if she's going to be... That's why she's shedding because it's cold. She's going to be a naked horse. She keeps shedding. Even though um, we don't think anybody's riding still today, we're going to groom her, tack her up, just in case. You never know. Somebody could show up and give her a ride because we're in the process of getting her retrained properly. She needs to... Learn how to be a beginner horse. <laughs> yeah, and she's been a pasture pup for two years, like Gabby said. So, so she's fat, lazy, and she takes off. We don't even know her real history. I guess that's one of the problems when you buy a horse. You gotta figure out the real history because a lot of the times the people selling the horse, they don't tell you the real history. I mean. Apparently she was a lesson horse, but race horse lesson horse is not really a good lesson horse. She doesn't want to meet the horse. <laughs> Look, who's that? Oh, she kissed him. One reason why I like Storm is he's got low hair type of horse. He hardly has any. And that, but that means you got to make sure his blanket doesn't get ripped by other horses. Because you're going to be cold. Right, Storm? You're going to be cold horse. It'd be cold horse. It's like, oh my god, there's Booker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Itchy, itchy. Yeah, itchy. Is. There it is, yeah. There you go. Hey, eh? better? So
the girls just got back from riding I survived the whole first um, time being alone first time being alone um, I didn't eat before they went because there just wasn't enough time and then it's like 4 30 and I'm eating for the first time today that has never happened to me before I'm having some chicken noodle soup mm, it smells so good I love it Gabby told me that she was really excited today and really proud of herself because she's getting to be a lot like me she like really pushes herself and to set goals what'd you do today Gabby no. that you were um, proud of Nobody walked Stella in no. the scary end, and I just trotted her in the scary end. Yeah. She uh, rode Stella in the scary end of the arena without, um, you know. No, one lap, like one full lap. Yeah, she did the whole full lap, and that's something to be really proud of. She's like, I'm excited she was for like, you. Okay. Trot a full lap and um, Stella's done. Um, so a lot of you guys were confused about yesterday's video, so I'm gonna just clear it up for a few seconds. Um, a lot of you guys probably don't know though that Gabby's stealing my soup. <laughs> Go ahead, have some soup. There's more. I'm sure there's more. Um, a lot of you guys don't know that. Um, yeah, a storm has to learn to ride with impulsion and he needs to engage his back end, his hind end, before she can collect him. And collecting him is going to make him so that he doesn't ride with a hollow back so that he doesn't get sore. So he is, has been getting sore in the past. So we need to do this. It has to happen. She has to get him moving forward. Part of the problem is the fact that he has a saddle that doesn't fit awesome. And um, part of it is that he's just a slow horse. So she, this is what she's been working on this whole last month. We're gonna jump because like we kind of jumped today. We did raise camera pulse three in a row because it's like a fan, it goes. So like And how did he do? We did good. We knocked it down. Oh, that's okay. But anyway, so yeah, that's why she's using spurs and it's gonna take her a little bit of time to figure them out and get her legs completely steady. Practice makes perfect, but um, we have to do this for Storm. She has to get him forward and it's been proving really difficult for her. So um, that is that with the spurs and also with the ear bonnet. Um, she's trying to desensitize him with the ear bonnet. Um, yeah, he doesn't like it. She doesn't make him ride with he it the whole like thing. Spurs? He doesn't, yeah. His old owner told like, us that he's like a really picky horse. Like if you say go over there, yeah. he'll say, no, I want to go over here. Like he, he always asked, has something to say. He did like a little crow hop buck thing. Did he? I asked him to canter and he was like, what? Yeah. And he has always done that, right? Yeah, he was uh, trained with like spurs like that big. Yeah, so he's Plus. not, he's, uh, yeah. Plus, when I squeeze him really lightly with them, and he's like, oh, what? Yeah, like, he, he's a perfect horse for Gabby. He's like, he, he they have similar personalities. But anyway, um, I just wanted to explain that. And we actually were going to tie the ear bonnet down. It's just the flapping that annoys him. Um, you guys can see he was just as annoyed with the ear bonnet as he was with the spurs. He just gets we annoyed. Can't tie it down. You can't tie it down? Oh, well, we were going to try. 
but I broke my pelvis and then uh, it just, yeah, all got away from us. But anyway, I wanted to share that with you guys just so you guys understand where we're coming from because sometimes it's hard to tell what, what we're thinking and where we're coming from, but that's the plan right now. But some of you guys are asking, Gabby, when the heck are you gonna jump again? Like, it's been a while. It's been a hot minute since you've been jumping that boy. I know, I want to jump, but so, we're jumping this today to see if Storm is going to... If I'm gonna do jump schools. Right, so what's happening on Sunday? Tell them about your ride on Sunday. We're riding with Kaylee and race car driver on Sunday. Yeah, we're gonna try a couple jumps. Well, basically, before I had my injury, um, we planned our last ride with race car driver before Christmas and it's gonna be on Sunday and it's gonna be Kaylee and Gabby and so they're gonna be having an amazing lesson. It's gonna be like, a, he's planning a fun lesson, something like amazing and fun for them and I'm excited. I wish I could go and see if I could get the heck out of this house in my wheelchair, I'll be there. But I just don't see how that's gonna happen. Um, in my news, I had a, uh, the occupational health nurse here today. She watched me walk. I'm a little bit more sore today because of all the walking. Um, my physical therapist is coming next Thursday, so things are moving along and I'm doing really well though, and I'm doing super well.